All right, so we're into the last two tracks on the album. So uh, track 14 on Desync is Love is a Gateway. Now, this song has um, a very serious background to it, which I will attempt to condense down for your viewing pleasure. Um, the long and the short of it is I had an amazing friend about five years ago, almost to the day. Um, she very, very suddenly passed away. Um, and I was left with a hole in my life and a massive, massive gaping hole in my spirit and my heart. And uh, I was left to face it up against like serious, serious grief for the first time in my entire life, basically. So this song tackles that subject of grief and of the disappearance of someone very, very suddenly as well, who might be extremely important in your life. It's such a, a diverse and unusual track actually on the album. Um, it goes through basically three movements with like a sort of fairly calm and introspective beginning section. The first third of it is that. And then the middle third is more like, it's, it's an expression of um, incredible angst and frustration. Um, and then the final piece of the, of, the, of the tune is actually more so like a revelation about the world, about life in general. So there's a lot to unpack here. But uh, I really hope you guys get something out of it. Uh, Love is a Gateway also features the inimitable Derek Sherinian, uh, former keyboardist for Dream Theater, current keyboardist for Sons of Apollo. Um, he's long been one of my favorite keyboard players in the world of rock and metal. Um, and I'm super, super excited that he actually features on one of my albums now. Um, you can hear his solo at the very, very end of the piece, at the emotional climax of the piece. And he also wrote that lovely uh, sort of piano stuff that happens at the very end. Um, so um, I'm indebted to him for his work on this album actually so big ups to Derek Sherinian and again thank you to all of you for watching and uh, I hope you guys really really love this tune this is the epic song of the album it is seven minutes long and again it has that movement like structure to it so I really hope you guys dig it